Hi, this is Josh from Aldi Reviewer, and we are taking a look at the Summer Waves Inflatable Dino Sprinkler, which also comes in a unicorn, which we don't have. And I want to talk about a couple of things related to this sprinkler right off the bat. First of all, it is interesting to inflate because you have to put water in the feet first, then you have to add air to the feet and the legs and the body. And of course, water and my electric air pump don't seem to go really well together. That's kind of creepy. We got it done, but you'll notice that um, it's still, eh, it still took some work. Um, you can see at the bottom where there is a little bit of leaking from the hose. I tried screwing that in several times, and that's just what you get. You also notice that the water jet kind of bounces off the nose too. I mean, I might be able to fix that with more air, but I'm a little nervous about adding too much air because I've heard stories about how people have popped these things. And when you have water and then you have air, you worry about the cavities between them getting filled. If you look at the back, this is where I filled it. I put the air pump there and filled up the main body that way. But again, that's not the only air cavity that you have to worry about. You've got the main air cavity of the body. Then you have two, one for each leg on this side, and then you have two more on the feet. And you have to fill all of those up. It's a bit cumbersome and awkward, and it took us a while to get everything filled where this guy wasn't falling over. We don't know for sure. He may have a tiny leak in the left leg. Um, we've had to kind of keep filling him up. But uh, we may, at the moment he isn't falling over, I suppose that's good. So we'll kind of keep an eye on this guy and we'll kind of see what happens.